What's up everyone and welcome to the 23rd episode of the Reading FC career mode. We're treading on very thin ice as we have been for the past few episodes. But will I get fired in this episode? Right, as we said in the last episode, we are 16th, which is not good at all. Seven games played, seven points. We're away against Everton on Saturday the 15th of October 2016. So we still have two and a half months before the January, tra the January transfer window. And will, will I even make it that far? Adrian in goal, back four of Stacey, Hector, McShane and Ferdinand, Abita at CDM, Atado, Norwood and Williams in midfield, and Mayuka and Dini up front. 4-1-3-2 formation. Straight away we're on the back foot, a bit of light kick saying McCarthy takes a shot and Adrian makes a good save. Dave Lefeo takes the corner and oh, Adrian comes out, doesn't get any, anywhere near it, he's in no man's land basically like Casillas was for Spain at the World Cup when they lost to Netherlands I think it was. Besic scores 6 minutes in and we have we got a rubbish start and the guy on the line didn't do a good job either, he just sort of stood there and was just like, yeah, you know what, we're only 1-0 down. We've been so bad now. Osman in some space. Another good save by Adrian. It's only been nine minutes. It's like, we're still dreaming, mate. We're dreaming of getting automatic promotion. Uh, sorry, not automatic. We're dreaming of winning the title. I'm thinking of a wrong league there. We're dreaming of winning the title and we're, we've just not woken up from that dream. Here's Lukaku now. Oh, no one makes a challenge. Oh, what is this? Disappointing so far. 20 minutes, Lukaku to Barkley. Barkley back to Lukaku. Oh my god, he still managed to, to score even as he was slipping over. He slipped over and still scored. And it's 2-0. Oh dear. Oh dear. Wait, what? What's going on? We just get, what the hell? We've just given the ball away. Did my, I don't know if my controller stopped working there. Oh dear. Oh my god, we're 3-0 down. What a calamity. What? Oh dear, we are seriously on the back foot. This become a cricket score. As the old cliche goes on previous FIFAs. This can become a cricket score, you know? Uh, and it, that shot just came off the post there. Osman now. McCarthy's free to have a shot. Oh, come on, it's off the post and in. Fair enough. Good placement, good a bit of accuracy there. Precision. McCarthy makes it 4 0. Only half an hour's gone, and I can see us just getting hammered. Right, finally we've woken up. Dini now in some space. Finally, the keeper's been bloody tested. Was it Tim Howard? For once, Tim Howard might be in goal actually. Yeah, Tim Howard. Woo! Oh, come on, that corner was rubbish. We need a goal now if we're going to get anything at all. A beater now. Oh, it's blocked. Really? Come on, come on, a beater now. He's doing well in CDM. Mayuka, I told you he was our only hope. Five league goals in eight games just for half time that is not bad five league goals in eight see Mayuka is our only hope up front actually he might be our only hope at all <laughs> right if you uh, like a minute or uh, however long it was ago like 30 seconds or a minute ago if you d realized that the audio changed because I switched from using my uh, webcam microphone to my microphone that I'm holding in front of me now which is why the audio seems different. So just in case I, I scared I scared you at all then, made you jump. Don't worry, I just changed the audio from the webcam to my mic and it's half time, we're losing 4-1 and it's rubbish. 90th minute free kick, will Norwood have a shot? We're losing 4-1, you might as well. You know, Tim Howard comfortably catches that. It's been an awful, awful showing from us. I can only but apologise. Uh, I think Everton had four different scores. Yeah, they did. Wow. Mika is our only hope up front. We lost 4 1. So let's check the messages uh, before everyone gets too depressed, as from the pictures you're seeing now. Well, if we've had an offer from the, from the Poland FA and they want to inquire about me, the possibility, sorry, of me becoming the manager of of the Polish national team. Now I don't have any interest in managing an international team at the moment. Our main, uh, sorry, our only focus at the moment is uh, avoiding relegation so that I don't end up getting fired even though the board want us to finish mid-table. If um, you haven't read the objectives yet, they want us to finish mid-table. It's looking like just avoiding relegation or low mid-table. 
So we're going to go ahead and decline this offer. Same formation and a beta instead of Stacy in the team. Yeah, and that's pretty much it. Same formation, even though we took a battering from Everton in the in the last game. Finally, we're on the front foot early on. Dini with a chance here. Oh, force a good save. Non get on the rebound and it's cleared. Norwood, Hurtado. Oh, another good save. Come on, we deserve a goal. Well, we need a goal. We desperately need a goal. No, come on, game. Be nice to me. Chip through ball to whoever this is. He gets past Ferdinand with ease. Ferdinand looks confused, half asleep, whatever. On drugs, we don't know. Oh, he's not showing signs of Rio Ferdinand, is he? His bloody older brother, Anton Ferdinand, makes a complete mess of that, mate. Come on. We're losing again. Hold on, hold on, talk about a swift counter-attack. Mayuka, here we go, he's in the box now. Gets past the defenders, takes a shot. Oh, it's narrowly wide. No, that would have been such a good attack. Oh, a counter-attack, sorry. Well, straight from kickoff, so, you know. Oh, come on, we have another chance here, another chance. Go on, Mayuka, run. Or pass, Williams, pass. Mayuka, just have a shot. Test the keeper. There you go, you test the keeper. Sort of. Well, it's fair to say that it's a better half than the last one against Everton. So, uh, we're 1-0 down at home against Hull. Now, the home fans, I don't know. I reckon they've given up on us. Another corner in from Snodgrass. It's close. What the hell? What? No. No, no, no. I'm not having that. Movis... That... Mm, chappy. The corner comes in. Adrian tries to take it. I think Williams, who's the, who's the man on the line, got in Adrian's way, so he couldn't catch it. He fumbles it. They both mess up, and everyone just stands still like they're in the movie bloody Frozen, literally, and they get a goal, and it's 2-0. I mean, honestly. And then, oh, what a quick turn of events. Told you, yes, finally a good bloody attack from kickoff. The kickoff glitch is still apparent in FIFA 16, mate. If you thought it wasn't, you're wrong. You're wrong. 59 minutes straight away. Come on, instant reply, mate. That's what we want. The only thing is, we're still losing, so we need another goal. Another two goals, actually. <gasps> yeah, and while everyone just calms down, including me, and <laughs> lowers the, the, the volume of their voice a little bit, shall we say, um, hopefully we won't concede another goal. I haven't jinxed it there, have I? Because sometimes they do jinx it, actually. No, they make a mess of it. Ha, ha, ha. Alright, here we go. Some guy passes it to Diami. Myla. Oh, come on, that trickles into the back of the net. Right. Yeah, and we've kicked off now. We've got 18 minutes to get two goals. Right, if we want to get anything from this game, I suggest we get a goal right about now. There you go. Mayuka with his seventh goal. See, you need a goal then if you're going to get anything from this game. And if we make it 3 all, you know, considering we were 3-1 down, then that would be a decent game. Here we go, Williams. Mayuka's running onto this. He's in loads of space, got plenty of time. You can take 12 minutes if you want, and it's a good save. Damn it, should have cut inside and done the same thing he did for his first goal of the game. And he nearly scored a hat-trick then. I've just realised he nearly scored a hat-trick. Maybe time for one last attack. This is looking... Okay, no, it's not. Never mind. Oh, no. Cocking hell. I'm so annoyed. You can tell I'm so annoyed. We, we could have drawn that game. We've lost 3-2. Look at this. The stats suggest that we should have won that. And we're not going to like this. The rating board, yes, no message. After yesterday's disappointing result, the board feels it's important to encourage you to experiment with the team dynamics to find a way to improve our outcome in the next match. Basically, what they might be saying, what they might be implying here, is that if we don't win the next game, I could get fired. Recent results, look at that. Disconnect, yeah, see? Wait a minute. 
more to the point we need to see more consistent wins from our side you read the last bit there we hope to see a change well if that means firing me that that's what they might have to do I'm worried now I'm worried more to the point we need to see more cons more consistent wins oh shit oh, sorry for swearing anyone who doesn't like swearing on this but um yeah oh my god we're in the relegation zone uh, yeah well two Oh sh no, we're against Man United as well. If we don't win this, that could be the end of the Reading FC career mode. Let me just put that into, you know, into perspective. If I don't win this next game against Manchester United, I don't care if it's home or away, all I'm saying is it's Man United, we're in the relegation zone, if I don't win this next one, then what do I do? I'm going to have to end the Reading FC career mode. Or find a new, new, new club to manage? Change the formation to 4 2 3 1. And it's basically the same team, just different formation. Hope this works. Oh my god, Pereira now. The lag again. What is this doing? Depay controls. Adrian comes out, doesn't get anywhere near it, and he freaking. Oh my god. The ball goes over Adrian's head. And we're 1 0 down. This isn't. Oh. I, I, I don't know. I seem to have just lost all hope. Here they come again. Darmian to blend the CDM. Pereira. Oh, leaves it for Rooney. It's an easy finish. And he's basically got as many goals as Mayuka has. But look where Man United are on the table. Top half. Where are we? Where are we? Relegation zone. Right, it's the second half now. Don't want to waste time telling you it's the end of the first half in this game because this game is important. Quinn shrugs off challenges. Shot! Yes! Come on, 2 1. That might be his first league goal, uh, you know, of the season, but I don't care. 2 1, 49 minutes. Could this half be the turnaround? Even a point would be something. Just not a loss. Come on, Schweinsteiger now to Rooney. He's ringing it. He can have a shot. What a goal by Rooney. Well, I mean, uh, Sh um, Shrek. Uh, I mean, Rooney. Shrek. Shrek. Rooney. Rooney. Schweinsteiger. Oh, what challenge. No. 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 He goes past. Oh, what are these side tackles. The defending is awful. We're all over the shop, mate. Schneidlin has made it 4 1. Third straight loss. We haven't. We've lost all three of the games we've played in today's episode. What's the point? They might as well sack me now. Just sack me now and then I can do some draft videos or something or whatever. Please comment below with your thoughts, by the way, on whether I should do draft videos or something like that. Or manage another club or a similar sort of club to Reading. Maybe Derby. Gareth McCleary has returned from injury. But, you know, whatever. I don't know how many more games uh, I'm going to play before I get sacked. I don't know if I'm going to do a lengthy commentary on this game as I usually do. That's 1-0 already. The defending, dear, oh my god, that's going to send us back to the championship. Mayuka's already hope he stumbles a bit, still manages to get it under control and keep his balance and not go down and try and claim a penalty or anything like that. Eighth league goal, Mayuka is definitely the only player worth having in this team. Okay, keeper saves it. Mayuka on the rebound. I mean, Mayuka is literally must be a one-man team. It's like we're Real Madrid. You know, all we've got is Ronaldo. Or when I say all. And we are winning. Let's just put that into some pers in perspective. We are winning thanks to Mayuka, Mayuka's brace. I've just realised that I'm doing four games in this episode. Uh... Oh, well, I'm going to do four games. Yeah, we've won against Aston Villa 2-1. And I've done four games. I don't know why I've done four games. But there we go. For an extra game for you this episode. Hopefully, I'll still have my job by next episode. And uh, be, able to keep, be able to bring you... Well, I don't know how many games next episode. If I'm still at the job, you know, maybe three games. Might be a game. Might be two games. Might be longer than that. We just have to see how patient the board is and everything like that. And... Hopefully they will be quite patient. And the next game is against Derby. We played 11 games, got 10 points. Okay, I can see why they're angry. But a mid-table finish, is that realistic? Really? 
Mika is the top scorer in the Premier League and we are 16th. You wouldn't believe it, would you? You just wouldn't believe it. And that's it for today's episode. We've played four games instead of the usual three. So an extra game for you this episode. Was it really worth it? Mm. Only that game was because we've lost three and only won one out of four. And you know what? It's only a matter of time before this Reading FC career mode ends. And it might be before June. In real life, that is. And before the January transfer window on FIFA. So it might be within the next couple of days. It might be next episode that it ends. So next episode could very well be the final episode of the Reading FC career mode. Anyway, thanks for watching and I will see you soon.